Hey guys, and welcome to another cool video um, uh, with Boost Mobile. So here we go. So today we are going to be looking at what the the newer Alcatel One Touch Conquest has, like mainly issues we're going to be focusing on today. So now that it's been out for some while, for a while, Jesus Christ, um, you know, I get feedback from customers. And like I said, first, first, let me do a little kind of disclaimer. This might not happen to everybody. Um, it could be, you know, a, a phone that's defective. So don't think, oh, you know, you have the conquest, it's gonna mess up on me or something, you know. With most cases, it's only some phones that do it, guys. So every time I do these videos of phones having issues, it could be some phones, but this one particularly, particularly, Jesus, um, we got a, a letter from basically the company saying, not well, not the company, but we got a letter basically saying that uh, they know that the issue does exist with Alcatel. Uh, and hold on, this, this camera starting. Give me one sec. All right, there we go. Sorry about that. Let me scoot over here. Okay, so basically, um, like I said, the, the first, the Elevate, the main issue with that one was that the text messages kept coming through like, uh, 10, well, not 10, about, about six or sometimes even 10 from what I heard, um, times, you know, you get the same message over and over and that's, that's a problem. Now with the conquest, the main issue, and I've personally seen it myself, especially when, you know, uh, where because half of our job is really troubleshooting or helping customers. So when people come in they're like, Oh, I got this phone, you know, I just purchased it like a week ago or something. And our return policy here in the store is like, you know, seven days or something. Once it elapses at seven days, we really can't do much, but just try to help you out. And, uh, yeah, if not, you know, you have to go through the warranty and if you have insurance, blah, blah, blah. But you know me, I like helping people out. So the main issue is this back speaker, the rear, the rear speaker of the phone for some reason sounds staticky. By I mean that it sounds distorted. It's a you know it sounds staticky basically. Um, another issue that now that someone mentioned to me, let me say his name. God, where you at, bro? He's pretty cool. Uh, CT Tech. Um, let me know that if it was laggy, and you know I haven't had much problem with it lagging, but um, that was me just you know running simple stuff, and now uh. I got another, I actually got a customer that came in and uh, said that, you know, his phone was kind of sluggish. And I was like, well, I do remember someone commenting on my video, um, CT um, Tech, and uh, told me that uh, if it was sluggish. And I told him, not really, but matter of fact, it is kind of sluggish. So, like I said, I didn't really push it like I am now. So now I downloaded high, you know, uh, big apps basically. And you can start, you know, kind of seeing it. You know, be lazy, basically. Well, not lazy, but, you know, uh, sluggish. Um, the, I, I'm thinking the main issue with this is it has, maybe it's the UI that it uses, but also, I mean, it only has one gig of RAM, guys. So, with that, of course, it's going to lag up on you, especially once you start filling it up um, with music. Like, for a solid hour, just download music and stuff um, and all this other good stuff. But, uh yeah, it's starting to get kind of sluggish, guys. So just just watch out. And it is kind of an entry entry level phone. It is priced at one twenty nine ninety nine, guys. Um, so remember, it's kind of an entry level phone. Now, what if you're starting a new line with Boost Mobile right now at the store? We have it for uh, fifty dollars. So fifty dollars, you're paying fifty dollars for a phone if you start a new line of Boost Mobile. Um, that is not bad, you know. the The phone is water resistant and shock resistant resistant and dust resistant and all that good stuff it does have a rear camera and front camera another main issue with the phone that i have that i've noticed personally is the screen resolution is not that high but you know you shouldn't really take or deduct points away from it just because of that especially being a you know entry level phone uh another thing before i end this video uh that i've that everybody that has this phone i've noticed it takes me forever to fix is uh, Facebook. Facebook not being able to download for some reason on this freaking phone. I just want to freaking strangle this freaking phone. Some crazy ass dude out there in the rain yelling, Jesus Christ. Um, but yeah, guys, no joke. Facebook for some reason would not download on this phone. 
even after I, uh, you know, I log into the account of the customer and everything. I try to download it. It, it downloads to 100%. Then it gives you like an error, error something, 4.404, something like that. I don't freaking know. Every other app downloads Pandora, downloads fine, Instagram, Snapchat, everything but Facebook. I'm thinking maybe because Facebook's so big or something. But the main, the way that I fix it, guys, is you have to, trust me, you got to do this like five, probably five times at least. Go into your settings, go into apps, delete the catch, everything, clear everything, the catch, you know, your defaults, everything. You want to go back to your Google and download uh, to your Google Play Store, go to Facebook and download it. Keep downloading, keep downloading, do that. It took me literally about five times and finally Facebook downloaded. Um, and I started to get worried, you know, I was like, whoa, you know, what's wrong with this phone? Doesn't want to download it. But like I said, after about the fifth time of me doing it, it finally went through. Um, but everything else, smooth. Um, so yeah, just just a little hint, uh, tip for you guys. Um, just watch out if you are getting the Conquest. Like I said, it's a pretty good entry level phone, guys. But um, and like I said, it could be some phones that have just come out defective. Like I said, it might be the bad apple out of the tree. Um, but I know the speaker I've heard it a couple times. The Facebook I've seen it about two, three times. Um, and the screen resolution, I mean, there's not, you can't do nothing about that. I mean, maybe what I do do though is I make it brighter. I make the screen brighter. That's what I do do it. And it does look better, guys. So, uh, thank you for watching my uh, video. Hope uh, I didn't take too much of your time out of your day. I just, like I said, I want to inform you. If you like this, give it a thumbs up. Leave some comments below and subscribe and share and all that good stuff. Thank you, guys.